Yeah, Michael, this oh, is an right example hand of your rival becoming your opponent, or your Yo, idol becoming up. your rival here. This is not where Adrian wanted to be in the opening seconds, Dragon. Yeah, this is a bad spot for Papua Bad Boy right here. He's got to try to utilize a little bit of space here. He's got to try to push on that head and really create some movement because this is a bad spot. Alex is dry. There's no sweat on these guys. It is the super aggressive start from Little Rock that I spoke about. He wants to finish Mateus early. Side control here for the former world champion. Yeah, this is a good spot for Alex right here. He's going to try to control the head, drive that shoulder into the chin of Papua Bad Boy. So now what we want to see from Mateus is he needs to try to get onto his side. He does not want to stay flat on his back right here. It's a bad spot. Alex is just going to try to settle into the position and then maybe even try to pull him away from the circle wall so he's not able to use the wall to get back up. In control, Little Rock Alex Silva over the Papua Bad Boy, Adrian Mateus. So you can see... Adrian Mateus is getting onto his side, but Alex tries to pull him back down. You can see him trying to utilize the fence to create a little bit of space and a little bit of movement. Close off the Alex fence. Alex is just like a boa constrictor getting tighter and tighter. There's a straight arm bar on the far side arm of Mateus, and Alex looks like he's trying to attack something here. He might step over, take an arm bar, maybe get into mount. Ultra aggression here from Alex Silva. Mateus in a whole world of bother. Silva almost pinned that arm down. Gonna soften him up a little more. Is this the beginning of the end now? Toss off, toss off. This the is a cru crucifix pitch. position. Adrian Mateus needs to try to regain his arms. He's, he might be able to slide out the back door, but Alex is doing a good job of controlling the top position. Slides into north south. There's a choke here. We saw it from Marcus Buchecha last time out. And uh, there's a possible the choke fish. here, but Alex might try to circle around. You can see him getting tighter and tighter with his left arm right there, driving his lat and his chest into the throat of Adrian Mateus. But Adrian does a good job of staying protected. Can I say, good call there, Dragon. Mateus surviving. A lot of people would have been tapped out already by Alex Little Rock Silva. North South position still here for the Brazilian. Is yep. this it now? There's the choke. Adrian Mateus is tough. He's trying to stay calm Catch. and stay relaxed, but he's getting tighter and tighter. He might go out. Fence off. Legs off the fence. Legs off the fence. There's Mohamed Sulaiman, our referee. Alex still trying to soften him up and tap him out. Is Mateus ready to go to sleep? Is it going to be lights out for Adrian Mateus here? Alex turning and turning. And no, Mateus still survives. It doesn't quite look like he had the position there. Adrian did a beautiful job of just staying calm, staying relaxed. You can see the squeeze that Alex was doing. You can see the face of Adrian Mateus turning into a different shade of purple. But he's doing a good job now of trying to create a little space. He always pushing on the head, trying to create movement. But Alex is so hard to get off top of you. Alex starting to turn again. And a reset here. Mateus still defending under two minutes remaining. It's been a hell of a long time on the floor. Oh, with Alex Silver. Oh, no. And Mateus back on his feet. Oh, Mateus should have had a moment there to get out. He should have stepped away. He should have got out of the... The washing machine, but Alex is going after a leg right now, attempting to lace up the legs. Oh, There's big the heel hook. Have a fist strike though from Andrew Mateus, and here comes Alex hunting for the finish again. Mateus got to keep moving. Oh, Alex, good job of staying on top. And how about Mateus defending? He's still here, Dragon. He He's right still way. here. That's a several submission attempts by Alex, but Adrian Mateus had the moment to get back he up did. to his feet, and he should have utilized it. He should have capitalized on that, but he might be able to ride out the last. What, 80 seconds here and work his way back up to his feet. Mateus finding a head of steam when he did get to his feet and it led to that mistake as the dragon points it out. We see Alex Silva back inside control here, pressed up right in front of our commentary position. Big knee comes down from Little Rock. Look at Alex Silva just dominating on side control position. Adrian's doing a good job of staying protected. He needs to keep his hands nice and tight to his body, not let anything get extended, because Alex is going to try to extend the arms, or he's going to try to lock up that arm right there. You can see him diving underneath, turning the corner. Good job by Adrian Mateus to negate the back take by Alex. Still, they get back up to his feet. Now Adrian's on his feet. Now he lands a hammer fist strike. Is he going to create some distance? No, the leg's caught by Alex Silva. Alex trying to put Adrian on his back. Does get him there now. Up kick from Adrian Mateus. Mateus has got to utilize those little separations to get out of dodge. He does not want to stay on the ground with Alex Silva. You can see what happens when he does. With 15 seconds to go in the first round, this will be an amazing story of survival for human dynamite Adrian Mateus. The Papua bad boy looks like he's going to survive an almost the entire round on the ground with a former world champ. He might not win the first five minutes, but there's definitely a moral victory there to survive. 
more than four minutes on the ground with Amazing. a third-degree black belt Brazilian Amazing. Jiu-Jitsu world champion. Good defense so right here. You can see him circling out, did all the right things, but this was his moment. This is where he should have gotten away from Alex, but he falls right into the, the leg lace there. And you can see Alex again knows exactly what he wants to do. He wants to stay tight to him. Look at him dropping the guard right there. Again, trying to attack the legs. They know in the corner of Adrian Mateus that he's got to keep it on the feet. But keep my the word, keep the distance. slippery, evasive, defensive on the ground. It lasted almost a full five minutes down there with Little Rock. And I'm telling you, not many people can say that. As Mitch said, it's going to give a lot of confidence for the Papua bad boy. Longer than me. <laughs> oh, oh he caught him! Here it is! There it is! There it is! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! The Papua bad boy knocks out Alex Silva! That's the biggest win in Indonesian mixed martial arts history! Adrian Mateus just knocked out the former world champion! He did it! It happened! Oh my! Silver protesting was early. I don't think Matthias can believe it. Silver is unhappy. He's saying the referee called it too quick. Should have given him a chance to recover. Oh my. Well, some controversy and jubilation. Look at that. Folks, you make the decision at home. What do you think? Wow, look at. Look at Adrian Mateus coming in with that right hand through one hammer fist. Alex tried to work his way back up to his feet, but the referee tried to save him from taking any more damage. But look at this, Papua, bad boy. You give this guy one opening, he's going to take you out. This will be debated. It will be hotly debated. Let's go to Tom Lau. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee, Mr. Mohamed Suleiman, has called a stop to this contest after five seconds in the second round for your winner by way of technical knockout, Adrian!